Hey, what's going on guys? It's Aspect here and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to reduce your lag, your stuttering, and how to improve your FPS in Call of Duty Warzone for the computer. First things first, we're going to go here to the search bar and we're going to search game mode. Once that happens, you're going to make sure you click off on your game mode. It's usually set to on. You're going to go to capture on the side, captures, and put background, background recording to off. Then the other simple step before we get into the in-depth stuff, you're going to go to your task manager, you're going to make sure you end task on everything you're not using. This is a basic tip, but I know it might be easy to miss. Okay, let's get to the fun part and that will be our actual graphics. For your display mode, you're going to want to do full screen. I actually tried all of these other ones out and full screen worked the best. For your display monitor, just make sure yours is, is displayed. For display adapter, you're going to want to make sure you have your graphics card chosen. And if you have a computer with an integrated card, make sure that one's not chosen. Refresh rate, you're going to want to use the highest your monitor can do. Usually, I play on a 144Hz monitor, but this video has actually been recorded on a 60Hz. Render resolution, so this one's very important. You're not going to want to touch that side that says 100. What you want to do is actually click on advanced and actually just change the display resolution as normal try to put the highest you can but if you are lagging the lowest I recommend you go to is 1280 by 720 P you will lose a bit of quality but you will improve your frame rate for aspect ratio automatic sync every frame rate v-sync disabled custom frame rate limit you're actually gonna want to max that out so you're gonna put it on unlimited Restart renders, leave that. Display gamma, leave it where it is. Texture resolution, very low. Texture filter, low. Quality, low. Bullet impacts and sprays, disabled. Now, you're gonna want it enabled because it is a BR and you do wanna see where the shots are coming from, but if you're suffering that bad, disable it. Disable this one as well. Shadow map resolution, low. You're gonna do cache spot shadows disabled, sun shadows disabled, the lighting, we're gonna keep it on low as well. We're gonna disable the ambient occlusion over here, the screen space reflection, disable it as well. Anti aliasing, we're gonna put that off. Depth of field disabled. We're gonna leave this exactly where it's at. Changing it isn't really gonna do much for your frame rate, so let's just leave it how it came. Motion blur, you're gonna wanna disable that on both world motion blur and on weapon motion blur. Both of those disabled. And the film grain, put it all the way down to zero. And that's pretty much it. That should honestly help your FPS move up by a lot. I hope I was able to help. If I was, please do subscribe, leave a comment, and thumbs up so other people can find this video helpful. Thank you.